Hi, welcome to Get Simplifies. I'm Vanessa Hayes. Today I want to share with you three tips on how you can make traveling with your electronics a lot easier. With all the different gadgets that we have and all the cords that accompany them, it can be quite a mess. So I'm going to share three easy tips to help make that a lot easier for you. The first tip is to wind up your cords. Just simply take your cord and wind it up. You can use this method called the figure eight, and I've actually done a separate video on how to do this. Um, but you can just do this, wind it up, wrap it around itself and tuck it through the loops on the end. And what's nice about this is that as you take it out and unravel it, there's no tangles or mess. So that's one way that you can do it. You can also wind up your cords using something like a rubber band or maybe a twist tie or a Velcro strip like you see here. The Velcro strips are really nice because they actually attach to the cord itself so you're not going to lose it. And that's why I like Velcro strips. Um, and you can actually check out a video that I've done, done on this one as well. Um, so that's the first thing, is to make sure that you wind up your cords. The second tip is to actually label all of your different components and the cords. So like you can see here, this is my camera charger, so I labeled it T4i because I wanted to be specific about which camera this actually goes to. So you can label this end, and I also label the cord end. And the reason why I do that is for two reasons. One is that when you have it plugged in, if you have a bunch of things plugged in and you got to undo them, you'll know which one you're actually undoing. And the other reason why I have this one labeled is because this is actually a, a two-piece component. All right. So if you have components that are in two or more pieces, it's a good idea to label both of them so that if they happen to get separated, then you know how to put them back together easily. So that's the second thing, is to label all your components. The third thing is that you want to contain all your items. And you can do this easily by using some Ziplocs, which is what my husband and I used to do all the time. And what's nice about this is that you can actually label the bags of what the contents are inside. And you can even use a smaller one, like separate some different items, and then put all of them into a bigger bag like this so it's still nice and contained. You can also use something as easy as or as simple as like little different toiletry bags and whatnot. The only problem I have with something like this is that they tend to, all the contents seem to go to the bottom, and so when you go to put it into your luggage, it kind of messes up your spacing and everything just kind of gets floated to the bottom. But there's another product out there that I really love. I just got it and I love it. It was actually a gift for my husband, but I kind of commandeered it for myself. <laughs> it's called a Grid-It System uh, by Cocoon, and you can find this at the Container Store or at Amazon. And what I love about this product is that it has all these different elastic bands that are kind of weaved or woven together um, in different directions here. And what's nice is that it has these little rubber um, or silicone little nubs on them so it keeps the components nice and secure. So as you can see, nothing's coming out of this thing. And so I love that I can put it all in one spot and nothing's going to move. The other nice feature about this is that there's a zipper on the back. There's this little pocket. Um, it's a thin pocket, but I was actually able to put my wireless keyboard in there, but it's also big enough to fit something like an iPad in there as well. Um, it'll fit if you have a thin sleeve on it. Even a thin sleeve on the iPad will fit in here, but not a too bulky one. It won't fit too well. So that's kind of nice where you can fit either the iPad or like a wireless keyboard in there. And it has this little loop to make it easy to kind of pull out. So what I like too is that it's just the right size where you can fit it inside of a tote like this here, my Saddleback leather tote. Or you can fit it the other way into this laptop backpack. So that's nice. And so it's just so easy to be able to pull out and have access to everything without it being kind of a mess. So those are your three tips. Wind up your cords, label your components, and contain them. So, I hope these tips have been helpful for you. For more tips on how to simplify and organize your life, visit us at GetSimplifies.com. Thanks for joining me today.